it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. All right, so here he is, one of the best boxers on this UFC roster. And if this fight was to be contested under the Marquess of Queensbury rules, it would be no contest, but we got an MMA fight here tonight. We would be talking about a one-round fight because right. there are no fighters in the UFC that can compete with this guy in that one form of combat. Such a great jab. The head movement, it's never on the line. He's constantly going left to right, right to left. It's like a triangle, he's moving. You can never see a stationary target in his approach. And what I truly love about him is his ability to really dig that left body shot yeah. to try and find the liver to end fight. We don't see knockouts like that very often. This man has done this a number of times in the UFC. The sweet science. Some oh, people think boxing is simple. It is anything but. This fighter has certainly mastered it. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. And now, one more time for the official introductions. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Levine. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 19 wins, 8 losses. He stands 6 feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Beijing, China, Lee, the Leech King Leon! Okay, protect yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. This fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist. But on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool play. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, he missed with that right hand. Nice punch there. Big head kick land. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. And he landed the right hand there. These guys throwing early. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Oh, he lands a massive... 
aggressive kick here. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Lee gets the tie clinch here. Big powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, beautiful one, two punch. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination there. Very accurate, a lot of activity in the hands. Look phenomenal tonight. Just unable to quite find that range. Overhand punch to the head, blocked though by Lou. Nice loop and punch. Ooh, head kick lands was hurt. And both guys really throwing with authority. Now connects with a right. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Great punch landed with so much power. Lee's kick blocked. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Lee gets hit with a kick. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Well, he misses with the left punch there. All right, single collar tie now. That's a big strike right there. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. <laughs> Connects with a right. Right under the elbow. The body keeps playing. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Guys landing at a pretty decent clip. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Lee. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, that right hand is on point. Punch is blocked. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Yeah, left hook found its target. Oh, beautiful strike there as he lands up top, and he does so right after catching the leg. So maybe you thought he would catch the leg and go for a takedown. Instead, he goes for the punch, and he certainly found the range on that one. Big punch land. Ooh. Lee's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Oh, is he a good counter striker? Counters beautifully with the left hand. A lot of high-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it, if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. Deep breath in. Good. Relax. Drink the water all right second round is underway your Ready? thoughts on what we saw over the Ready? first five minutes i saw a very competitive round and very strategic expect these guys to really pick it up as we go forward in this fight big head kick just misses with the straight right connects with the right hand pretty good punch that one nice right punch by this young man Yes, that you heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Caught that kick there. 
Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. Now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch. You better protect that head. Great job securing the Muay Thai clinch. Watch for big knees to the body and eventually him switch it up with a big knee to the head. Nice body. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. And that one certainly found the target. Big head kick lands. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Uppercut attempt does not get to the target. Nice job defensively there by Lee. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Ooh. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively tonight. He does a great job of moving his head side to side and really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Good stick. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. He is throwing a fast, straight hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Lee's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Back and forth we go! What a point. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy to him. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also very fast. Look at the hand speed, right? Nice jab, follows it up with a nice right hand. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Pretty good right hand. Plus right hand is true. It's a good right hand right there. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Ooh, what a punch. Head kick. And he counters with a left hand. He blocks the punch. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, nice counter. You can't place it or time it any better. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Liver kick. Final seconds. Oh, nice jab by him there, and I guess on the other side, hard to get your offense going when your head keeps getting snapped back like a Pez dispenser. Every time he tries to go forward and use his own offense, the jab is stopping him in his tracks. He's doing a great job of fighting behind him. Oh, he hurt him bad with the jab. All right, a lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. 
both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such a to even be on his feet right now. Real nice body kick lands. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. And we got a fight on our hands. Oh, big left. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Punch over the top. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. Nice job of hiding that head kick. saying I wish I was a little bit taller. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Oh, that's a nice straight punch there. Through the punch, got to the target. Well, you gotta think he's happy with this performance here tonight. Essentially, just the way he drew it up, it's been a striking point. It's like a fairy tale. He's doing everything he wanted to do and his opponent isn't doing much to try and deter him and really mess with the game plan. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. There's the kick, it's blocked. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Oh, good kicks. He got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is the technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Nice punch lands over the top. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Lee's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Big kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. All right, so he leads with the right hand there, and it was effective for him. Most times he's behind the jab, but sometimes you gotta just mix it up. Ooh, big shot land. Right hand on point. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Got clip with the right hand. There's no tell on that leg kick. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Back and forth we go. Big body kick land. Nice punch land over the top. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Seconds left. Oh, collar tie. Right hand punch. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Lee. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? 
His timing is on point. Nice straight punch. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. All those extra hours to put in the gym really paid off that. All right, another round is now underway. Pretty good previous two rounds. We'll see who makes the requisite adjustments now. The adjustments are going to be the key, John. When you're doing everything... Whoa! Whoa! Over the top. This fight's going to be over this time. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He did stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent. He was going low. And now he's got to hurt very bad. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Signs of bruising now on that left thigh. He lands flush with that right hand. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Good punch land. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. There. If you're boxing these guys and only boxing them, you will be in trouble. Down the left. Straight right hand, no good. Great punch. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Lands with the right hand. Big leg kick land. I mean, this is his game here. Control your opponent's posture, land those nice elbows around the top. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Land right there, his opponent's Robert Chan. He's hurt bad. This dude needs to grab. He needs to wrestle. He has to do something. He cannot take another shot like that. And there comes the separation now. Right hand punch with the clinch. Oh, big left hook there. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Right on the button. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, seeing active, keeping busy, doing great work. Big punch lands through the middle. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Switching stances here. What a body kick. Oh, that straight punch is going to be a real problem if they can't make the adjustment. A real problem. He needs to move his head defensively if he's going to avoid getting hit so many times in the face. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Nice. Oh, big head kick land. Nice counter shot there. All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocked, and he's rolling, he's slipping. He's doing a great job. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't finish the Oh, he might be out. He gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense. Here. Under a minute to go in round four. Ooh, 
blocks the shot. Misses with that punch. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Again going back to the gym. Such a sneaky head kick he did not recognize it. Coming high, and now he's got a hurt bad. Way to hide that leg kick. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went headhunting, landed, nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. on that offering. Beautiful body kick. Oh, a huge block there. Well, if you're gonna leave your body that wide open, you're gonna pay the price, and he certainly did there, as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. Good punch. Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the... Oh. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Wow! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. Nicely done there as he forces the miss from his opponent. Able to land the single ground strike there. Good solid strike on the ground. Under two minutes remain in the fight. All right, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High level grappling could really be entertaining. You now he's on top of him looking for a finish. Solid strike on the ground.
All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the ground. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. One minute to go in the fight. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do. He's gonna start. That'll do it! And that'll do it! He got him! Pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 15 seconds of round number five. Including the winner by knockout, Lee Lee Jin Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's sleeping tonight after what he was able to produce here. He's gonna be smiling for a really long time. When you get a knockout like that, not only do you get the win, but also, most times walk away.